Today, I will show you how to mount an M.2 NVMe drive on a laptop. I have this M.2 SSD module in this computer here. But first, subscribe to the channel because I post new videos every week. So, we have to start by opening the computer. I've already removed the screws from the computer. Now, I just have to remove the cover. And we reveal the inside of the computer. This computer has two M.2 slots, which use the 2280 standard, which means it is 80 millimeters long. And this computer supports two modules. And this is the module that we are going to install, a 2280 module. This computer does not have an intermediate screw, so we cannot place a smaller module size, only 2280 modules. This is the M.2 connection. This computer only supports M.2 SSDs, so we only can put M.2 NVMe modules. So, how do you install an M.2 module on the computer? Here, you have this M.2 module, which has this notch, which will fit the notch on the computer's M.2 slot. This is a 1TB module, 80mm long, and it has to fit in this position. This notch on the SSD is on the right side, so if I turn it, this notch is now on the left side, and so it's no longer possible to fit it. The slot only has one position. Placed in this position, the notch is on the right side, aligned with the slot notch on the right side, and that's how we are going to fit it. Then you just have to position the SSD in the slot. The module fits in but it's tilted because it is not secured. To secure it, you will need a screw, which may be included. So now let's press the M.2 module lightly, so that the circle on the module is aligned with the screw hole on the computer. Then you place the screw, and with a tool, you just have to tighten the screw to hold the module. You don't have to tighten the screw tightly, because it's just to hold the M.2 module in place. And now secured with a screw, the module is parallel to the computer's motherboard, so it is properly installed, and we can now place the cover back on the computer. Fitted this way and with the screw in place, connecting the M.2 SSD in the computer is completely safe and correct, and this is what you need to do to replace or place an additional M.2 module. This computer has space for two M.2 modules, so I can place another M.2 module to expand the memory. And it's easy as that to install an M.2 module on your computer. I hope this video helped to learn how an M.2 module is installed on a computer, either on a laptop computer or a desktop computer. But now, subscribe to the channel because I post new videos every week, like the video, and if you have any questions, write in the comments.